G'day fellas and welcome back to the TNT RTG. So real quick, let me get a look at who's actually offered us, right? Because we're going to go into the rosters and see where we fit in. So Notre Dame, I'm considering. LSU, I'm considering. Ohio State, definitely Texas. If anything, I actually really want to go to Texas. USC, Oregon, Baylor as well wouldn't be bad. So Baylor's got an 89 middle linebacker, Dylan Doyle. The first season of the RTG runs against the first season of college football, though. So this guy's a senior, meaning he wouldn't be there. We would probably start at Baylor. Same thing for LSU. They have two seniors here that are 85. Notre Dame, they have an 89 overall junior. This would be a bad move for us. Ohio State, no, we cannot go here. They have a 91 who's a junior. We would be buried on this death chart. We would be the fifth string. Oh my God. Goodness, they've got more linebackers than anybody. Legitimately the seventh string. Why would they even offer us? Bush wouldn't be there. Devin Richardson wouldn't be there. If I'm being honest with you guys, it's probably between Oregon and Texas. Well, Flemlo went to Oregon at one of his RTGs, so I don't feel like going to Oregon. We are signing, we are committing to the University of Texas. All right, so we're gonna start the season rank 14. Oh, it feels nice being a big dog. Nah. We're 89? Wait, what? I've never seen... Nah, that can't be right. Man, we could have gone to hella schools and started. Bro, we're going to be a 99 this season, our freshman season. 84 speed, 79 excel. We got to get the agility up. I need the agility at least around 85, and then we can move on from that. Tackling's an 86, 86 play rec. 89 zone, damn. Bro, they made TNT OP. What's our hit power? 74? We're kind of good in areas I don't care about. Like, just give me agility and hit power and call it a day. In our first game, as a true freshman, we are taking on none other than Coastal. This will be a lot of fun, man, especially now that I know we're starting. We don't have to worry about practice or none of that shit. But yeah, without further ado, fellas, let's get on into it. Oh, we are home, though. Man, Texas, their stadium's a little underwhelming, yeah? <laughs> I wish it was a little bit bigger than this. That's okay, though. There's a lot of history where a blue blood. Texas is one of the best college football teams of all time. And now we're a part of that. Doesn't get much better than this. Gonna bait that in. He's taken off. Ooh, third and 17. It's not looking too flash hot for these enchanted clears or whatever they're called. Took away that route. Uh oh. He dropped it. Okay, we're driving. We're driving. It feels so good to actually have an offense. We aren't gonna get the first down, but it will take three. As long as. Our first drive is points, and that's the important thing here. Got a nice purple in the middle here, too. Can't get off the block. Come on, I have like 94 block shed. I wonder how much the tackling will take us up on Coach Trust. I know it was pretty trash in the high school level, but maybe it's good in college. I don't know. Uh-oh. All right, again, it's going to be fourth down. They do not get a first. Can we score, though? Yes, okay. The offense is legitimately okay. They're good. It's a good sign for us. A very good sign. Is that my first tackle? It is. What do we get? What do we get? 18. That's not bad. If we get 18 per tackle, we get 10 tackles. That's 180 points off rip. Counter. I'm there again. Beautiful. This has the potential to get really disgusting. Depending on what kind of stats we can get. Oh, Tino with a pick. Oh, breaks a tackle. He's still going. Let's go, man. First quarter and Tino's already snagged one. How many points do we get for that, though? 75. Already 111 out of 100, Coach Trust, in our first quarter. Tino was just meant to be a linebacker, bro. He wasn't meant to be a safety. He just wasn't going to cut it at free safety. We are destroying these guys. I almost feel like saying, you know, I'll let you guys know when they get a first down at this point. <laughs> it's only the first quarter, though. I'm getting a little bit out of myself, but... They are just struggling so much. I put it on 12-minute quarters. I don't know if that's too many. I think maybe 9-minute quarters is the play here, to be honest. It's almost time for Coastal to give the control to somebody else, you know, nearly 21 scum. And I get, our defense is just way too overpowered. They can't do anything. <laughs> oh, we nearly had another one. We even had the animation. 
screen. No, I got blocked. I'm still getting blocked. I don't remember what the score was. Is that another touchdown? I think it might have been three. They have 13 yards. Oh, I feel bad for him. That's a dot right there. They finally, they needed that. Ooh, we're playing coverage. We're, man, we're really fast. You see this? We have a lot of... Oh, that's my man. That is... Ah, they're going to go for it on fourth down. This looks like a run to me. If I'm... Coastal, I'm running this. The corner out is open. He dropped it. That's got to hurt, man. Grayson's like two from eight. But if you take out the drops, he's pro he's really good. Like he's six from eight, but there's just been so many drops. Go from there. Slants. Ah, oh, man, that could have been our second pick right there. That was bad zone coverage to me. No way. That was, I wasn't on the flat. <laughs> what? Maybe because I went outside my zone? I'm not really sure. That's my tackle. Yes, sir. That was bad zone again? Nah, no way. So if that goes below zero, does that mean we lose our starting job? Probably, huh? I, I kind of forget that the RTG things are a little bit BS a lot of the time, so... Uh, it's a little bit tricky. That did count as our big hit, though. Um, I don't I don't think we got there first, but I'll take it. Yeah, I don't think we're going to see him call a screen for the rest of the game, that's for sure. It's, it... Okay. <laughs> I was wrong. I was very wrong. I think when I did 12-minute quarters, that was at quarterback with the Darius Knight RTG, but now that we're not at quarterback, maybe 9 minutes is a bit more balanced. Because this scoreline is kind of ridiculous, isn't it? It's taken off. We didn't make the tackle. Okay, we're straight up blitzing. And now that we are at the college level, I have no problem with blitzing. Uh, we're 89 overall. We have really good block shedding. I think we could genuinely make some big plays at, uh, you know, coming off the edge, blitzing, defensive line moves, etc. So if we do get the blitz, we're going to go for it. Because why not? What do we have to lose? Apart from getting blocked, that is going to be a big problem. That's my tackle. Let's go. We have five tackles and one pick in the first quarter. I mean, the first half. There's still a lot of time left. We might even get more, but... Sacked. Okay, so we know that these guys love calling screen plays, though. So we can at least go from that. Uh, we're going to score on our first drive. We also take a shit ton of time off the clock. Three minutes, ten seconds. That's almost a quarter of the quarter gone. It is a quarter of the quarter gone. Okay, I'm looking for the screen. Nothing else but the screen. Now, they've caught it three times already, so. Come on, I'm almost there. Can't wait till we get, like, hip power and stuff. And agility. Oh, that's going to be disgusting when we get agility. We dropped it again. Screen again. We are out there this time. Our teammates already picked up on it, though. Oh, I tried to intercept it. We get the tackle. We take it. Texas calls a lot of just straight coverages in the middle, which is perfect. I absolutely love just being on the middle purple. It lets me roam. It lets me do what I need to do. Oh, I made him do the splits. And again, look at this. Big purple in the middle. If you'd asked me before signing... You know, this is definitely what I would have preferred. I'd just do this every play if I could. In all honesty. Oh, we injured him. So who they got in as a backup? Oh, no, I feel bad for this guy. Imagine coming in down 41 to 7. Maybe he's a beast. I don't really know. Wow, he, uh, was that a bullet pass right there or really, really slow? He must have really low throw power. Oh, Grayson's back out here. They needed that. There we go, we got it. Yes, sir. Tia fell to us as well. And we're not even in the fourth quarter yet. If we get over 10 tackles, I'm dropping the minutes. That out route is butt naked. Oh, we took him out. He had no idea we were running up behind him either. That's bad. I'll tackle again. That's 10, fellas. 10 tackles, one TFL, one interception. Uh, the problem is, right, if we do keep it on 12-minute quarters, we're going to get way too OP way too quick. We're already going to become OP way too quick. So I'm not trying to extend that, you know what I mean? Man, they're 
to be fair, their screenplays, their blocking has been phenomenal. To be fair, I don't think we're going to be out here for much longer. We'll probably end up getting benched at some point here. And they, they will bring the backups on, for sure. That's our tackle again. So in that game, we came away with 12 tackles, one TFL. We got another interception in the computer control. That's going to give us 3,300 points. Do we have any upgrades? Though? We only have one, really, that we can apply, and that is haters will hate. The only reason I'm picking this up is because I really want the agility. The Excel is just a bonus to that. And yeah, that's going to boost us up to 90 overall as well. And next up, we have BYU. Wait, they're better than us? How? <laughs> All right, so we're not going to do anything on our first drive. We only wasted, what, 41 seconds? So not a good sign for us. Toss, we out here. We're going to get the first tackle of the game. That's going to count as a TFL as well. Oh, my goodness. Tino, please, bro. Just too overpowered. That uh, agility in Excel, we're going to put it to good use today. Very good use. Sacked. All right, we are one play away from holding BYU to a three and out. Are we going to see another screen? We're not. Oh, Tina can't make the tackle. Oh, fourth and inches. They might go for this. Man, we're struggling out here. We did not end up doing anything with our drive. And uh, it's the thing about BYU is it's not their defense that we should be worried about. It's their offense. I'm sure our offense, though, can manage to score on this BYU team. You know what I mean? Gonna get there. Come on, good play. I, if anything, I thought that was bad zone coverage. But now, according to the game, that was legit. Fourth and inches. They didn't get it. First team to flinch here loses first points. Okay, they got bunch. Somebody's going on a flat, which is good because we got a flat. Just a run. I see that route. <laughs> uh, our DT is the only one that's hot right now. The only player on Texas is hot. I see that in route. Taking it away. Did have a running back route there that they potentially could have gone to, but uh, they decided not to pull the trigger. This could very well be a screenplay. That's mine. Let's go, Tino. Oh my goodness, it's going to be a pick six. Yes, sir! I told you, first team with a turnover loses. Not only the pick, but the, to get the pick six. I mean, you give your team all the momentum. 75 for the pick. 11 for the defensive stop. 37 for the touchdown. Wow. I think you get a little bit more trust for uh, scoring a touchdown on defense. I mean, come on. Pretty ass because it basically means that a touchdown is the same as three tackles. You know, so you could just get three tackles and it, you could call it a, a touchdown. I dropped the minutes down and I, I feel like it's fine now as well. We're still in the first quarter. It's not like the game's over super quick or anything. So far, we've just got a bunch of ones. One tackle, one TFL, one pick, one touchdown. Now let's see if we can't get another tackle here. Assisted tackle, maybe? All right, we're blitzing. Let's do it. Oh, nearly jumped. Oh, I almost got right through by faking him out. Oh, no, we must have given the ball over off the, the punt. Look at the field position for BYU. Defense is uh, making it tough for him, though. We've got a lot of people going. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to cover the middle of the field. You don't need me blitzing here as well. See, look at that. That curl got wide open. And now I'm running cross field. Don't think I can get there in time. Wait, are we manning up the O-lineman? Okay, that's weird. I've never manned up an O-lineman before. That's a good play. Got a hard flat on the right. Finally! We're there for it. We drive him back. Already down to third and eight. We're jumping in man coverage. It looks like a big wide receiver. Damn. He's way bigger than us, and we're like 6'2". He tried to throw it back to our side. That would have been a pick for sure, but Sack is going to get there first, so you can't be mad at it. We, again, are going to do nothing. We have 70 yards. So I guess our offense is just going to be trash, huh? That's what it is. I'm just going to go hit the quarterback. Yeah. 
That's what I thought. Try and put pressure on him, I guess. We're going to have to do something here. Okay, we got it. There's no way. I specifically didn't make a play on it because I'm like, our defender is literally in front of the bloke. There's no way he gets that. I don't know how we fit that in. That was nothing short of a miracle right there. Now we covered up our assignment. So we're going to start out in the second half on defense. Uh, our offense that last week dropped like 50 points is now being held to seven in the first half. And not over 100 yards. It's not looking to flash up for the Longhorns. That was a nice move there. That was a good hit. All right, big third and 13. I'm happy to cover the entire middle. Don't need any help. Everybody stay out of the way, please. And thank you. There you go. See how easy that was? We almost just got an interception right there. Another thing as well, uh, we saved all of our points. The only upgrade we got was like 3K. So after this game, we should probably be sitting around over 10,000 points, which is good. The only thing I'm a little bit worried about now, and I'm kind of stating the obvious here, yes, is that uh, we've only scored 14 and we scored seven of that. We scored half of that. So I don't know what exactly is going on with our team right now. I, I don't want to have to be the reason we win games, you know, by getting pick sixes, because it doesn't feel authentic. We're there again. Oh, get there. I seen it. I saw it. Third and seven. Yeah, I kind of would like it if we had, you know, even if it, this was a cover three, but we had two yellows in the middle. Now, just to give our, our teammate a little bit of help there. And they go to the wrong slant. It was a good play, though. Get out there. Man, we really struggle with these blocks. Number 69 just kept pushing me into the freaking end zone. This just means that at some point we're going to have to score seven, which I don't like our odds. Through three quarters, we scored seven points. I get to <laughs> see that. It is going to be fourth down, though, so I assume they are going to take three. Uh, what's going on with that offense? This Murphy guy was so cocky and arrogant last week. We have Bajan Robinson. So how are we struggling this much? With Bajan Robinson out there, you got to think that we would be dominating on the ground. But Bajan's just not having a good game at all. Well, nobody's having a good game for that matter. All right, cover six. We typically do pretty well in cover sixes. We're a volcano. This could be a screen as well. I'm looking out for the screen. I'm there for it. I am there for it. Didn't want to risk the pick. And there you go, Alexis for 33 yards. We're going to go for three here. I mean, I hope we get, I don't really want to go to OT though. <laughs> we have 165 yards. We almost had more freaking yards on our pick six. It's up. It's a good... Tino, if there was ever a time to get a pick, it's right now. Man, coach is so... I love whoever this coach is, the defensive coordinator. Every play call is so good. Like, this guy's genuinely a legend with his play calling. Dang it, I chose the wrong man. He dropped it anyway. All right, we just need three here. Bajan going for one yard. There you go. 10-yard penalty in the offense. Man, we drop a lot of passes for a blue blood. We definitely drop a lot of freaking passes. Let's see what we got. We caught a wide receiver screen. Wow, we completed that. Okay, I was shut my lips. With 11 seconds left, that's perfect timing. Offense did exactly what they needed to do. And this is their play. This is the play BYU went for? Okay, I'm going to have to drop back here then. Wow, that is well off target. And it's picked. We are going to squeak out with this game, man. I don't know. At some point, we didn't deserve to win it. But in the end, we do get the dub. We do go to 2-0 here. So in that game, we came away with 8 tackles, 2 TFLs, and of course the pick 6. We are now up to 8,100 XP. Well, fellas, that is going to wrap up the very first episode of the college era of TNT. If you made it this far in the video, then you are the real MVP. I hope the rest of your day is awesome. And for me personally, I'm out. Peace. Sometimes I'm when they cannot breathe right underwater. Sometimes I'm when they cannot speak in outer space. Sometimes I'm when they cannot call.